Is there really a need for a reason to eat chocolate? It is one of humanity's most treasured sweet delicacies. Several researches have been conducted to investigate the validity of chocolate intake and found some very astounding health benefits. Minerals including iron, magnesium, and zinc are abundant in dark chocolate. Dark chocolate includes antioxidants known as flavonoids, which may have a variety of health benefits. Cacao, a plant rich in minerals and antioxidants, is the source of chocolate. Commercial milk chocolate comprises cocoa butter, sugar, milk, and trace amounts of cacao. Dark chocolate, on the other hand, contains far more cacao and significantly less sugar than milk chocolate. In this video, we look at some of the possible health benefits of dark chocolate. We also go through the risks and precautions, and how much to eat. Number 1. Antioxidants. Flavanols and polyphenols are two antioxidant-rich compounds found in dark chocolate. Antioxidants destroy free radicals and avoid oxidative damage. Oxidative stress is the harm that excessive concentrations of free radicals may cause to cells and tissues in the body. Oxidative stress adds to the normal aging process. Over time, the consequences of oxidative stress may also lead to the development of a range of illnesses, including heart disease, diabetes, Parkinson's, Alzheimer's, cancer, and eye disease. Number 2. Reduce the risk of heart disease. Eating dark chocolate on a regular basis may help lessen a person's risk of acquiring heart disease. Some of the molecules found in dark chocolate, notably flavanols, have been shown to reduce two key risk factors for heart disease, high blood pressure, and high cholesterol. Blood pressure. Dark chocolate contains flavanols, which boost the body's synthesis of nitric oxide. This causes blood arteries to dilate or expand, increasing blood flow and lowering blood pressure. Cholesterol. Dark chocolate also includes polyphenols and theobromine, which may reduce low-density lipoprotein LDL, cholesterol levels while increasing high-density lipoprotein HDL, cholesterol levels in the body. LDL cholesterol is commonly referred to as bad cholesterol, whereas HDL cholesterol is referred to as good cholesterol. Number 3. Anti-inflammatory. Inflammation is a normal immunological reaction to pathogens and other potentially dangerous elements in the body. Chronic inflammation, on the other hand, can cause cell and tissue damage and may raise the risk of certain health diseases such as type 2 diabetes, arthritis, and certain cancers. Dark chocolate includes anti-inflammatory ingredients, which may aid in the reduction of inflammation in the body. Number 4. Reduction of insulin resistance. Insulin resistance develops when cells in the body cease reacting to the hormone insulin. Insulin resistance can result in unusually high blood glucose levels, leading to prediabetes and type 2 diabetes. A review investigated at the connection between frequent dark chocolate eating and blood glucose levels. According to the study's findings, eating 48 grams of 70% dark chocolate per day may help lower fasting glucose levels and improve insulin resistance. Number 5. Improved brain function. Eating dark chocolate may improve brain function and help prevent neurodegenerative conditions, such as Alzheimer's and Parkinson's. The flavanols present in dark chocolate may enhance neuroplasticity, which is the brain's ability to reorganize itself. Number 6. Boost Mood. Out of 8 studies on chocolate and mood, 5 showed improvements in mood. Further research presented at the 2018 Experimental Biology Meeting found that eating 48 grams of dark chocolate increased neuroplasticity in the brain, which could have positive effects on memory, cognition, and mood. Number 7. Help with weight loss. Dark chocolate may play a role in controlling appetite, which in turn could help with weight loss. Neuroscientist Will Clower, wrote a whole book on the subject called Eat Chocolate, Lose Weight, which describes how eating a bit of dark chocolate before or after meals triggers hormones that signal to the brain you're full. Of course, eating more than the recommended amount per day can counteract any potential weight loss. Number 8. Good for skin. Dark chocolate is packed full of vitamins and minerals, like copper, iron, and magnesium, which are beneficial to your skin. Manganese, for example, supports the production of collagen, a protein that helps keep skin looking young and healthy. Other minerals, like calcium, help repair and renew skin. Now let's talk about risks and considerations. What are the side effects of dark chocolate? 
Although dark chocolate contains beneficial antioxidants and minerals, it is usually also high in sugar and fat, which makes it a very calorie-dense food. Dark chocolate contains fat in the form of cocoa butter, which mainly consists of unhealthful saturated fats. People should, therefore, try to limit their consumption of dark chocolate to avoid consuming too many calories, fats, and sugars. So the question now, is it okay to eat dark chocolate every day? And how much dark chocolate should I eat a day? Even though quality dark chocolate is a better choice than milk chocolate, it is still chocolate, meaning it's high in calories and saturated fat. To avoid weight gain, the recommended eating no more than one ounce of dark chocolate per day. What is the best time to eat dark chocolate? You can enjoy dark chocolates as often as you want. However, for a person who wishes to lose weight with these chocolates, dark chocolates should be eaten on an empty stomach or 30 minutes after a solid food meal. They can also be eaten as a snack between lunch and dinner. Thank you for watching. If you like this video give it a big thumbs up and share it with your friends. And if you haven't subscribed yet don't forget to hit that subscribe button and click the notifications bell to receive all our new videos. And be sure to check out our other videos.